it's past his prime here and welcome back to surviving mars where we're continuing our playthrough of the challenge modes and we're about to start a new challenge uh, we are going to do the boundaries of knowledge where we've got to have uh research 100 technologies repeatable technologies account once uh within 250 souls Right, what is the conditions? We are Space Y, we are a politician. Game rules, chaos theory, no events. Uh, what the hell is chaos theory? Let's have a look. We get six billion dollars, five starting rockets, 200 research per soul, that's good, 20 million rare metals. Dragon rocket, has smaller cargo capacity, 40,000, but is faster and requires less fuel. We have a solar array, a large cluster of solar panels that have lower maintenance costs but are vulnerable to dust storms. Drone hubs start with additional drones, 50% cheaper advanced resources. All funding gains are increased by 20%. Bonus tech, Martian patents, repeatable tech that grants funding. Tech fields, all tech fields are fully randomized. Disables all random events. Is that what the chaos theory is? don't know it doesn't really say unless that's what it is tech fields are fully randomized whatever i guess we've got to roll with the punches what are we getting we are getting two drone hubs one sterling generator one rc transport and two probes and the usual the usual suspects all right, so if we've got to just research technologies, this is going to change a little bit. Uh, mainly, my strategy is going to be the cheaper the, the research, that's what we're going to do. Let's quickly pause. Okay, we want to at least start a tech. That'd be a great idea, wouldn't it? So what I mean is we always usually skip these two columns in the challenges because they're usually of no value to me now doesn't matter it's all about the cost because the cost is going to give us better outcome so if we've got one two three four five six seven techs or seven whatever you want to call them paths whatever um oh what have we got to get we've got to get at least 10 in each would be 70 so more than that that'd leave third that another four so at least 14 15 in each so that's one two three four five six seven eight ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen uh Oh my god, is that is that literally almost all of the techs? Jesus, how many is there? Actually, one, two, three, four, seven, eight, nine, ten. I don't know if I can tell. Eleven. Oh, it's hard to count with the scroll. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. Yeah, I mean, yeah, you might not have to get all the way to the bottom, but you might have to get fairly close. We might be looking at about here or here, something like that. I don't know, it's hard to count with the scroll. I can't actually keep a marker. But anyway, that's irrelevant. So we may as well start. They're all the same price, so let's see if anything's worth starting with. Well, that definitely is worth starting with because that gives us extra research. Now, the prices are even, right? Well, see, that's 2,000. What's that? 3,300. That gives us more money. Okay. Jesus, they really are pretty crap starting ones, aren't they? God. Actually, that's pretty good, that one. Turning buildings back into prefabs is great for relocating. Ooh, 
Well, it's just at least to add five in because, like I said, it's all about getting them all, so. Right, we can't research. Oh, okay, so it's putting us up here. I didn't pay attention to what the statistics were. What were we going to be facing? Hmm. Is there a way to look that up? I don't think there is. Oh, well. I don't think it would be in here. Um, yeah, I don't really know how you could see the statistics of the area again, but anyway, there's probably a way. I just, whatever. Uh, so we've got two, two. So if we say we're going to go here, well, oh, I'd really like some water. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. I meant to do this. Okay, there's some money. That would be good. Okay, do most of the surrounding areas. Okay, so, uh, what does that give us? Comfort boost. Concrete there, concrete there. There's plenty of metals on the ground there. That's pretty handy. So I guess we're going to land over here somewhere. I don't see any other resources. Uh, I'd like some water. That'd be really nice. What did we get? Transport. Okay. Okay, we got to go with our usual stuff. So, well, we're going to start with the don't. Now, here's the thing, right? So, it's all about... So, we've already got one. So, it gave us that first one with money. So, there's no point redoing that one unless we really need the money. Um. Okay. So here's the thing, what is the best way to get the most research? Because in theory, right, you could just not even bring people. You just go, well, there's no value, right? If people don't contribute to anything, then let's not bother. But if there is a value, like research, then you would bring people or making money to pay for stuff. So I guess that's the point. Oh, I love these. They're, they're good because I, I end up building my own arrays in a way with these things. It's just like, just so time consuming though. Okay. Well, we're going to go with the dome for a start and we're going to get that lovely dollars in there so let's just pause okay so ooh, start from the start All right usually a drone hub we will have to put somewhere i don't know where i want it yet until we get that taken off hang on come back to that let's get some concrete going Where's the water one? Okay. Let's 
So that's not in the vicinity of the comfort. Make sure we get power across everything. I'm gonna put a build a sensor. Okay, everybody keeps telling me to build a landing pad. <laughs> and I know I should. Well, maybe we should just wait until we actually need to land something. But I've gotta try and remember to do it because I never do. Right, we have a sterling generator. So let's put that down. Um, what do we got? Not much. Yeah, they're huge. Okay, let's come back to that and that. Man, if I had paid attention to what the uh, weather stuff was going to be, it would be so much better. We are not going to build that yet. But we will put a cable in. Alright, so we need a moxie. Four of those. Now we have no water. We have no ability to get water. So that is really interesting. What the hell are we going to do for water? And are we going to need heaters? Turn these off since we have no water. We are probably going to have to bring something in. All right, we better build a universal. Concrete, we'll do a dump over there. We will eventually do a rear metal over there and a dump. It's probably enough of that for now. Hmm, and we might have to do some flattening because there seems to be a lot of uneven ground. Well, that was instant. Is that meant to be instant? I don't know. Okay, let's get metal bring it down here All right let's prioritize that and 
that. Let's go. Come on, guys, get the cable. You get the cable. Come on. There we go. Now we can start getting some concrete. So, we're making 200. That's good. We didn't bring a... Subject we didn't have a... Scanned. We don't have an explorer. We don't have a fuel thing. Hmm. Okay. So, should we bring a rocket? Instead of paying for pods bring a cargo rocket because what I'm gonna want is I definitely want an explorer I'm going to need a couple of those fuel refinery don't know about the rest yet better commander we're we gonna need a commander don't know hang on let's have a look uh yes we will if we want to get down here we are going to need a commander. Okay. Hmm. That's a lot of money to spend. Straight away. But. Where do we land everybody? Well, we could definitely land there all right i think it's probably the smartest thing so let's go back in here so we want two of those one of those uh explorer commander well we'll get a drone hub out soon we could get... No, can't afford that. There we go. One drone. Alright, let's do it. Might be a big mistake, but hey. That's what we do. We make mistakes. So why don't you get all the metal and put it there? Uh, Tin concrete. Can we express that? Sector scanned. I just want to land on it.
Beautiful. Okay. Now we can go and do that. The commander. I don't know, you come over here. And feel free to drone away. Sector scanned. Okay, so we have everything sort of paused. Uh, oh, hang on. We don't need to. We brought in some water, didn't we? Yeah, you forgot. Wait, how? Okay, we'll put you there. Uh, should we just go with the two straight away? So, if we have water, we might as well build these. the fuel go anomaly analyzed milestone achieved There's more to the barren and vine. Wow, they really have shuffled these, haven't they? This must be the chaos theory, because we got big domes here, or medium domes. It's like, okay. Bizarro. Uh, go and research that one, please. I want to make sure I get all the ones in the vicinity of us. Okay, water's coming up. Are you saying we don't have enough power? Well, that could be a problem, couldn't it? I mean, it seems like a bit of a stupid place to put it, I'll be honest. I mean, the thing is, we can flatten that, so I'm not convinced that's a problem. Now, if we put solar, we're going to need some of these. We'll start with three. So there's a metal deposit. Uh, we still haven't found any water. Sector scanned. Research complete. Oh, uh, okay. We've done three. Okay. Well, we're on a roll now. It's all happening. 
Now, some of these are as cheap as each other, so... Not that that actually helps. But then again, these can all lead to something better. Okay, we'll do that. Uh, yep. Keep going, buddy. Oh! Well, there's a meteor already. Okay. We don't want to rush the building of this, but do we have to get... We haven't got a drone hub in here yet. We probably should do that. Anomaly found. Just, oh, you built it already. You weren't supposed to build it that quickly. With Mars, and you'll find it's any. Okay. Sector scanned. Resources are low. Oh, we know. Don't you worry. We know. It's a coming. Okay, so we've got enough power in the day. Got to get those batteries charged up. Okay, drone hub is good. So you, we could bring you up there. Okay, I need the research more than I need unlocking research. Uh, okay, they're charging up nicely. We'll have to see how much that'll store. So far it's saying 13 hours, so that's pretty good. Okay, let's build a... A fuel depot right there. Okay. That's pretty good. Not enough power's being lost to really make us worry. I guess it's time to start building the dome. If we're going to get people here, we might as well do it. Research complete. The question is, what is the point of the people? Oh. You know what? I'm going to shoot that to the top. That's pretty damn useful. <sighs> I knew that was going to happen. Now, we start spending money. Okay, let's get our Trent thing over here. Starting to bring back all the lovely metals. Sector scanned. Oh, 
I don't know whether this, there's no bloody water here at all. It's ridiculous. deposit there get you to grab all of that metal and put it over there dome is coming up Milestone achieved. okay there's another 500 research now we've got to design the dome so we need some expansion now if we go this way we could get metal we go that way, we get nothing at all. Problem is, I built a thing here, didn't I? So I would have to destroy that if I want to go down this way. There's a stupid elevator. That's got a nice research boost. There's also metal there. That's a long way away though. Even that is really. I mean that's probably three. If you stretched them two domes away. Or a train ride. Oh, I mean no. I mean I could do that with a drone hub. I could. That'd be way cheaper than a bloody... Uh, train that's for sure would be just put a universal here and stretch it because that actually you don't even need to that covers it so I mean I'd still put a universal here anyway so that would be our other dome I would say Okay, I'm going to do something here. I'm going to flatten all that and that. I don't know if we can get to that, but we're going to attempt to flatten that. Okay, but we're supposed to build this first. Okay, so you're going to want a living complex. Say there. There. They use electronics, which is a big, big problem. Space bar. Diner. Medical. Grocer. Okay, food. Um, I think the indoor ranch is going to be the best. Milestone achieved. Oh, hang on. Where did we find water? Crap, that's a long way away. Okay, well, we at least found some.
Okay, we need to bring in some people. No tourists, please. Thank you. Thirty-five. Oh, these don't require as much fuel. Oh, I like that. Okay. If we get this one off the ground, I could land there. Because I was thinking, oh, do I need to build another one? Which we will, but... Actually, no... No, we can land there. It's going to be a while before we move to another dome. Settle down. Jeez, man. What's this guy doing? What's he doing? I thought he was supposed to be bringing the metal over. Wasn't he? Why'd he stop? Sector scanned. Why does he do that? Mate, there's metal over here. What are you doing? Go. Oh, what happened? They just stopped building it? Oh, God. Okay. Why is that uneven? I thought I flattened it. Oh, I just landed there. Research complete. Milestone achieved. Okay, colonists moving in. Alright, let's pause. Uh, should have gone straight to turkeys, but... I mean, that could be a problem. Okay. Stop, stop. Okay, we'll leave it at that for the moment. Anomaly analyzed. So we can deep scan now. Okay. So they're getting Dira. All right. Well, we just keep things cheap as possible. Yep, alright, we're locked into a Founders, that is still turned off, which is fine, I'm happy with that. This guy has finished, so can you please unload it over there? Now that you've collected the metal in an area. Sector scanned. Get all the metal there and bring it back. How are we going? So we can do the deep now. So let's go back over what we've already done. Ah, of course, we're losing. Resources are low. Hmm. Yeah, that's nowhere near enough. We need to turn that off. Oh, there's the prefab thing. Refab. I like it. We're going to have to buy... We're 
gonna have to buy more. Can't do much else. Ah, plan planetary anomalies. What have we got? Any we can do. Any seven people. Probably not the greatest. Five engineers. Any nine. The problem is... We probably can't... I mean, we can do it, but we won't be making any food then, and we're all going to starve. Because we've only got 12 people. Uh, I think we need to wait. The problem is I don't want to go and send these off. Sector scanned. Man, it's all about the research, though. That's the point. Well, that's resources. So you could skip that one. New technologies. Well, that, that's probably the one you wanted. It's 12 hours. Damn it. Milestone achieved. Well, okay. Uh, can we build another Briefly landing pad? Anomaly analyzed. Printed electronics allows drone prefabs to be constructed in the drone assembly using metals instead of electronics. Jesus, that is good. Now, I'm assuming these will count. Uh, not that we need that, but it's just like, well, okay, well, that's just 2,000. So once we get to that level, oh, yeah, you want that too. Okay. Okay, keep going with the thousands. Let's not get carried There's away. More to the barren environs. So, I've been told that these can overlap, but I don't know by how much. The problem is, if I put it in the wrong spot, are they then going to stuff each other up? Okay, let's see what happens here. Research got, complete. Got to get some positive water here. Then turn the fuel back on.
Okay, we do want that. Another hundred. Okay, we'll land you. Um, okay, so you could go back, but... Okay, I only got five. Ah, uh, okay, hang on. We're not making anywhere near enough power now. Wait a second. I need to plan this out. If we're going to do a dome. Now, here's the problem. Do you make the dome cover that? And again, maybe it's a matter of having two domes, right? So you have one there. All right, one there. Let's turn that off. Because that's not the point of what we're doing here. It was just planning. Okay, well, that's going to be interesting. Okay, so we've got any seven to get resources. Five engineers. I doubt we have five engineers. We have three engineers. Resources are low. Okay, the SETI gives us lots of money. It is worth doing once we've got money to buy stuff. What? Our colonists are suffering from... Not anymore. Reward. One atomic accumulator prefab. That is for generator 100. Okay. So atomic accumulator. That is a very handy. Absolutely. What is the maintenance on that sucker, though? I didn't look at that. Sector scan. Okay, still getting all the metal. Anomaly 
found. We've collected valuable geographic data at the site of the anomaly. Wow. Okay. Jesus, I haven't had that before. Um... Tell you what, I'm tempted by the drone hubs. The water's very good too. I'm going to take the drone hubs. Now, was that anomaly? from meteors so let's wait uh, I don't want to send him over there he get broken I'm gonna put in another array Well, I'm not going to complain about all these anomalies, that's for sure. Okay, it's finished. All right. Let's go. Oh, why do you bring that up? Okay. Building a new home on an alien. We'll get some food out and then I'm hoping oh you know what we don't have. We don't have a little food one. Okay. Uh we produce food. We did another research. So that's a 2,000, but we can go back to a 1,000. Is that serious? The artificial sun <laughs> is being randomly pushed up so far, it's 2,000 research to get the artificial sun. I mean, it's going to cost a goddamn fortune to build it. But you would never have to worry about power again. Oh my god, we We've gotta do that, surely, come on. Oh yeah, but what's the maintenance on it? All oh, the arcologies, they're good too. Oh man. I like this chaos theory thing, it's it's quite interesting. The stuff you get. We've still got the thousands to do, but they're just crap. They're just crap, man. Alright, well. Um, Commander's just sitting there. We've got drone hubs coming out of our butt that we could build if we wanted to. But there's no value right now. And are we going to put in research labs? Which is going to cost us a lot of electronics. That is going to be the question. Mmm. Right, but that's for another time. So, if you like the channel and you want to support it further, check the description below. There's a link to a Patreon site and a link to a virtual coffee site. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel, please do consider subscribing. That really helps the channel out immensely. And I really do appreciate the support.
Most importantly, leave a comment below. Let me know what you think of the game. Let me know what you think of this challenge. Have you done this challenge? Got any tips, pointers for me? Thoughts, opinions, all that sort of stuff? Let me know. Um, yeah, I'm happy to get advice from everybody. Or if you want to ask me questions as well about any of the other challenges or anything in general about the game, if you feel I can help, feel free to ask me. Um because I read all the comments and I answer every comment that warrants an answer as soon as I possibly can. Hopefully you've enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching and I will catch you in the next one.